Hi! Okay, it's Monday, which means we are doing a video for you guys today. And two weeks ago, I went through insect repellent ingredients, and I promised you I would go through insect repellent brands. So that is what I'm going to do today. We got a little sidetracked last week because I had to bring up the diaper drive, um, which I'll talk more about next week again. But today we're going to focus on the insect um, repellent brands. So like I said, um, ingredients were discussed two weeks ago. So look for that video to go over um, what ingredients I recommend and what I think is great. Okay. So there are um, a few big brands that you're going to hear a lot about which um, a lot of them have a, a good selection uh, within their brand of different the specific ingredient you might be looking for so cutter is a big one off brand repel coleman um those are probably your big ones and then um a newer one which is a more independent one um, is dr doug which you've heard me talk about that so we'll go through that too so um, first ones, these are just ones that I have in my house, by the way. So I'm not going to show you bottles of everything because I didn't go to the grocery and buy everything. I'm just showing you what I have and what we use at home. So, um, this first one is off family care. Um, this is an older bottle that we have and this one has D in it. So like I said in a previous video, if you are going somewhere where we are, um, concerned about certain types of ticks and mosquitoes that carry certain illnesses and you really want D like in a heavily wooded area, this is a nice one to have, okay? And it's got that low percentage of D that we talked about. So I like this one. And um, Off does have, um, I believe it comes in, it has like a brand that is just natural uh, botanicals as well, but this is the one that has D, just so you know, just so I can show you the example. Um, next, Repel, another brand you've probably heard a lot about. So this is the um, plant-based lemon eucalyptus. I love this one. Um, my kids don't mind it either. It, it does have a strong smell, a very like lemony smell, but I think this works really well. I know the lemon eucalyptus um, and the more natural ones get a little bit of mixed reviews, but my whole family has had great success with this one. So I really like it. Um, this is DEET free, just so you know, and it does not have um, picaridin in it either. And those are like the two main ingredients when you're going more in that deep woods area. So like I said, a newer one, um, which I just got this year is Dr. Doug's Bug Potion. This is gonna be like your most natural, least, um, chemical one out of all of these that I, I've talked about in general, really. Um, the ingredient list is very small. Your main ingredient on here is your is lemongrass oil. So there are two different ones of this. Um, there's the regular bug potion, um, and this is a stick. I'll show you this. It's not in a typical spray bottle, which you're used to seeing. It smells amazing. It smells like lemon. Um, and this one's kind of cool because it has zinc in it too. So maybe like at three o'clock, four o'clock in the evening, maybe everybody's come in, taking a shower, and then you're going back out, but the sun is still shining, but the bugs are out too. You've got this one that has clear zinc, and zinc, if you remember, is important for um, the sun and the uh, UV radiation blockage, so this one's pretty cool in that it's got almost like a sunblock in it, but not a true sunblock in it, so... Those are some insect repellents, guys. I hope that was helpful for you. Um, please give me ideas for videos, things you want to hear about. Just comment below. Whatever you'd like to do, um, I'm here for you, and I'll do my best. So we will be doing a video on cicadas. When these babies pop through here pretty soon, in the next few weeks, um, I will be doing a video on these lovely creatures. So stay tuned for that. <laughs> Bye, guys.